guys now we are making a bluetooth control rc car I mean uh, we will control this car from our phone by use of a app cxcm card by operating it through the buttons of the app so what we need first of all uh, we need a changes but we don't have so we have cut it a uh, board and we need uh, first of all we need a arduino uno uh, bluetooth module of ac05 and a motor controller and i am using l298 and we need two dc motors you can see and two wheels one two and a castor wheel you can see this is a motor controller and this is for uh, this will uh, we will connect our right motor with this mean our right wheel and we will connect our left wheel with this and here is the motor controller VCC pin and this is the ground pin ok so we will first connect our motor controller with the uh, wheels then we will connect it with the Arduino Uno so first of all uh, these are the wires of our right wheel and we will connect it with our right pin of the motor controller ok we are connecting uh, okay it's done then we will connect our left motor with our left pin of the motor controller and this is the left pin you can see this is the left pin so uh, we are connecting the our another motor and these are the motor pins and these are the motor shield pin we are connecting them okay now it's time to connect our this motor controller with the arduino uno board and here is the four pins and we have connected them with the four jumper wires this is the four pins of the motor controller and we have connected it with the jumper wires here is in1 in2 in3 and in4 respectively okay we will connect the in1 with the arduino pin number 3 then the IN2 with the Arduino pin number sorry we will connect the IN1 with the Arduino pin number 2 IN1 to Arduino 2 and we will connect the IN2 with the Arduino pin number 3 and respectively we will connect the IN3 of the motor controller to the Arduino pin number 4 and lastly we will connect the IN4 of the motor controller with the Arduino pin number 5 okay let's time to join our bluetooth module with the arduino so in the bluetooth module we are having four pins rx tx ground 5 volt sorry rx tx uh, ground and 5 volt and we will not use this state and enable pins okay first we need to connect the rx pin of our bluetooth module to the tx pin tx pin which is the zero pin of the arduino board and we have connected it and we will connect the TX pin of the Bluetooth module TX pin to the RX pin which is the number one pin of the it's only number zero pin of the Arduino board 
mean the TX the RX pin of the Bluetooth module will be connected with the TX pin of the Arduino board and the TX pin of the Bluetooth module will be connected to the RX pin of the Arduino board okay then we will connect the ground then we will connect the ground to the ground of the Arduino board to the ground of the Arduino board here here you can see we have grounded okay then we will give power supply no. then the lastly we have the 5 volt pin of the bluetooth module which will which we will connect it to one of the breadboard pins we have connected here okay then we are having and here in the motor controller here is vcc pin we have connected a jumper wire with it and in the ground pin we have connected two jumper wires because one of the jumper wire from the ground pin will go to the ground of the arduino board will go to the ground of the arduino board and to and another wire of this ground pin of the motor controller we have connected a switch switch so that we can operate it when we will on it it will be on and when we will off it it will be off then uh, we will connect the vcc pin of the uh, motor controller in series with this of that mean of that mean 5 volt of the bluetooth control module in series okay we have done it here okay then after that we will give the power supply the positive end of the battery will be connected in series with these two in the breadboard okay and uh, also and the, the negative end of the battery will be connected with this switch to operate this i have said it earlier then i will just connect a jumper wire in in series with this three in the breadboard and we will connect it in the five volt pin of the arduino here it is five volt five volt where it is this is a vein this is a ground this is a ground here is a five volt okay we have connected it then we will check whether our circuit is okay or not i will put on the switch yeah the circuit is running you can see the motor controller is on our arduino board is on and our bluetooth module is also blinking so our circuit is okay to upload the code to our arduino you know through the software arduino software from our laptop and this is a code you can see here and we will first compile it to see whether the code is right or not and we will click the verify option here and it is compiling the sketch and here the it is compiling the sketch and it's done compiling and one uh, one one of the uh, important thing is before uploading the code we have to open the rx pin from the arduino board I mean this one we have to open the rx pin before uploading the code so we have opened the rx pin and our code is ok so we will just upload this code in our ad main card we have clicked the button upload and here it is uploading and after a while it will be uploaded and it is done uploading then after uploading we will open this open this and uh, we will uh, close these things and again we will put our rx pin within the Arduino board after uploading then it's time to run the car time to run this this is time to run this we will put on the switch here sorry so guys now our bluetooth control RC card is ready to move on and we will first put on our switch and you can see the circuit has already started blinking so now it's time to open our bluetooth we will first open our bluetooth we have opened it and here it is already paired here our device ac05 so there is nothing to do we will minimize it then we will open a software cxcm card we will give the link to download this card in the our comment box and description box and for getting the code please do comment in our comment box and do subscribe and like for making this uh, and okay let's start the card so we will open this cxcm card and 
you have to do a thing you have to go to this menu you have to go to settings and to the mac address it is a mac address of our bluetooth module okay when you will do this same project you have to find out your mac address of your bluetooth module by there are many softwares in the google play store and you have to copy that and paste it here and you have to just click this ok after that you will go back then you will click on button control sorry you will click the button control and then just operate the card you can see in our phone when i when i will say forward it will go forward when i will give command forward it will go forward So guys when I will give the comment forward it will go forward you can see I am pressing this forward key and it is going forward when I will press backward it will come backward to us and we will click right it will go to right you can see when we are clicking left it is going to left and when right it is going to right and then forward then backward left right and you can also I mean turn it 360 degree but it is not going because of these words are inside we have to set these words accordingly so guys enjoy this project video do all these things and you obviously can do it like us and please do comment if you face any problem doing this and if you want the code please do comment thank you